Hi all, welcome to the latest video for Twisted Cards. So today's video, um, I went and grabbed a load of these. So let's be real now, everyone's looking for that Charizard within the Evolutions packs. So I've taken the punt. Um, I only managed to get a handful of them within Tesco's offer um, due to one of my good friends just going out there and getting them for me. So I got really lucky, I got a handful. Um, we didn't take them all because obviously want to let kids be able to have the chance to pick up some cheap packs um but for me i've got four of these to open um so it'll give us a couple of chances to pull obviously the evolutions um, i've pre-opened this pack because i wanted to make sure um there you go so you'll watch me fight with the other three um as i had a little fight trying to get into this one so i know almost certainly that it comes with a little proxy card which is one of these um it's when you build the setup, it gives you a nice little picture. Get a coin, um, pretty cool looking coin to be fair. It's one of the moments I've got a lot of, but hey ho. So, tin wise, pretty cool. Um, if you do like a display, like I've got behind me, they're pretty cool to have in a box in a display. Um, for the packs, though, you get a evolutions, which is quite nice to see that, and one of those. Sword and Shield, not as keen on the set, but you know what, I'm not going to complain. Um, is there anything that I'm really sort of chasing after? No, not drastically. But there could be some full arts in there. There could be, I think it's like the big parasols in that set, which is pretty cool. Um, coin is the same. We got Crookie. So yeah, oh, look at this. Evolutions wise again. So art pack, my boy Snorlax, and another Charizard. Score bunny one. So I know from the pack side of things they were talking about these and there was a reprint run which meant it come with Darkness Ablaze and it come with oh, pick them up. Um sorry, different coin that one. Yeah, there was a reprint run and it come with Darkness of Blaze and it come with Burning Shadows. Um, I know it upset a lot of people on that front because obviously they were after getting the Evolutions packs. So from what I can tell, judging by market at the minute, this is the cheapest way of getting Evolutions. Um, even still at £9 a pack, um, your local Tesco will sell them still, uh, local Asda will sell them. I've heard rumour that you can pick them up from... Uh, Sainsbury's and the artwork, so I've got two score bunny ones or Uh Yeah, so I've heard rumours that you can pick them up in the local your local Sainsbury's. Uh, B&M, you can pick Pokemon cards up. B&M is at discount price as well, so that's pretty cool. Uh, without further ado, though, so we're three minutes in and I've not opened any cards. It seems rude of me. Got my sleeves ready for once. Let's jump straight in. So we're going to go with Sword and Shield um, first, just because I want to get in Sword and Shield. And then we'll save the Evolutions for last. Historically, these haven't been the best of like tins for me. I never get great pulls or overly great pulls. So I'm hoping to pull something good. But I'm not going to hold my breath. Uh, oh, Haunter. Nice little card. Faki. Pull pad. Hey, Sobble, that's a pretty cool card. So I'm just like, I'm hoping that, you know, these sort of prove me wrong and, you know, we pull something decent. Hey, Score Bunny to go with the pack art. Crabby. Yeah, so that wasn't the best to start. So non holographic for the final card. I just kind of hope that I don't get proven right with it. And I, I, I do get something nice, but at £7.10 for two packs. With the market how it is, you know, you can't complain. You know, for the shot of pulling something nice, you really can't complain. Water energy. Great ball. Potion. A few trainers on this one. Ride on. Uh, Muna. Rosalia. Tutti. Tutal. Chu. I'm going to go with that. It's pretty cool. Pokemon in the game itself. Uh, Blitbug. Rhyhorn. At least I can involve that one in theory. Hoot hoot. Oh, two for two. So, 
Oh wow, how do you say that? Mashana. I think I, I think I said that right. Not a bad card either way. Next one. So you're gonna play fair and let me get in. Yes, you are. Look at that. Happy days. So so far the sword and shield packs have not been too great. I'm hoping that bodes well for the evolution side of things and they pull well. Uh, oh, that is a pretty cool looking card. And it's a, a Salazzle. I think I said that right. Uh, metal, metal Saucer. Rotom Bike. A couple more trainers on this one. It's pretty cool. Krabby, Kufan. Uh, oh, Baltoy. Don't recognise you at all. So that's a new one for me for the set. So I am looking to try and complete all the sets that I've started opening. I know it's going to end up expensive in terms of like burning shadows, that type of thing. So Salandit, Ponita, Reverse Frostmoth. Again, that's the first time I pulled that one. That is actually pretty awesome artwork. Ah, you again. Yay, non holographic. Free, <laughs> free for free. Last Sword and Shield. Is it? Is it? Is it going to be nice? Um, I will say, if you manage to get this far into the video, please consider hitting the thumbs up on the video and actually hitting the subscribe button. It really does help us grow as a channel. Um, based on the polls, I probably need the biggest pick me up ever because we're four packs in, three have been bust. Team Yell Grunt, Hit One Lee. I like the fact that if you pull the Hit One Champ, you got the hit while in the background, so that's pretty awesome. Rhyhorn, uh, Minchino, Chow Chow, Chin Chow, Chin Chow. Oh, that's a new one for me as well. Krogunt, nice, nice, nice. Meowth, so at least I'm pulling uh, Pharisee reverse, at least I'm pulling some stuff for the actual uh, mod set that I'm trying to build so that's pretty cool feeble that's at least you know two maybe three new cards that pack alone so I'm, I'm okay with that so evolutions times we have one of each artwork so I'm gonna start with Charizard we're gonna go blast with be noise Charizard this is where we hope hope and hope and I've got to see if I remember the card trick I think it's free on evolutions I think it's free. One, two. Uh, I, yeah, I think it's free. Machoke, Coffin, Kakuna, Boltorb, Diglett, Catapy, Poliwag, uh, Pikachu. Hey, look at that. So, yeah, it was free. Happy days. And an electrode, which seems to always pop up for me it just seems like a guaranteed that's the card you're going to get but a small hit of nostalgia there for me i've not opened many evolutions i think i've opened about seven eight packs total so to be able to have a look over some of the older stuff is you know always a pleasure but i'm getting slightly concerned that we are you know really pushing into the packs and there's no sign of a holographic so Charizard's Spirit Link, Kakuna, Full Heal, Magnemite, another Pikachu, Machop, Weedle, the Duo, Reverse Drowsy. Don't do this guy's following me. Reverse Drowsy though, we'll take that. It's not bad, it's not bad. There's a few cards there on the evolution side that I know I've not pulled yet, so. I'm okay with that, I'm okay with that. But I'm slightly concerned I'm on pack six and uh, seven and I've not had a pull yet at all which sort of makes me go, ah, I played a lot of money for bulk. To be fair though, all it takes is one good pull and then you're sort of back to where you need it to be. Uh, Blast Horse is Spirit Link, Pidgeot Spirit Link, is Spirit Link, will it? Energy. Pikachu, Growlithe, Machop, oh god what are we on, Nidoran, 
forgot what that was called then. Tangler. I mean, at least it's not an electrode. Arcanine. Pretty cool ability. A lot of damage. Ha. When you start praying to every every card god known to man, and it's the last opportunity we're going to get in this opening for something. Last pack magic. Come on, come on. Oh, something, anything. Okay, what have we got? Metapods. Oh, okay. Emakuni's do Duo. I'm, I have never seen that before in my life, so I'm going to set that aside. So I think that's going to be one of the secret rares, to be fair. Haunter, Growlithe, Machop, Foltorn, Diglett, Caterpie, Metapod. Hell yeah. So we got the Mega Evolution for the Venusaur. Wow. Pose active is now paralyzed and poisoned. Jesus, that's a bit harsh. Okay, cool. I've not had one of these before. This is the first time seeing one like up close. Uh, centering don't look too great from what I can tell. But you know what? I'm not about to sell it, so I'm cool. I'm happy with that. I would like to obviously that we've got the Charizards, but I am never going to complain at that. That is awesome. Let's get that straight in the sleeve. Get in. So, uh, sorry, I'm happy, I'm happy. Um, first impressions on the tins. Um, for the cheapness on the packs, yes. Um, £3.50 a pack, you can't go wrong with that. Um, when you think if you buy a standard blister, it's sort of three ninety nine, I think it is in most shops, or £4.50. Um, or if you go to Tesco, you know, the better part of a fiver, because Tesco are tight. Um, and Evolutions obviously being what it is. So I'm happy with that. So my one and only pull. Last pack, bit of magic, and we got this bad boy, which I don't know much about. So I'm, I'm curious to the ins and outs on that to the point I'm going to sleeve it just because I think it may be a secret rare I think of, well it must be a secret rare but I'm not sure if it holds any water to what it is so I'd like, rather keep it in good condition so one day when I'm old and grey if I do decide to let go and play from cards you know cool I'm in a position I can do so still if you got this far in and you haven't already done so well, why not um, please hit the thumbs up hit the subscribe it'd be nice to count a few of you you know within the ranks um we are forever growing sort of i say daily but we're not daily quite yet but we are weekly and uh, we're always stepping in the right direction thank you for taking the time to have a watch and i'll see you all in the next video